Hey guys, uh, welcome to my second uh, update video on uh, learning Japanese. Uh, it's been a bit of a rough month for me. <laughs> it started out pretty good after the first video, but it kind of quickly fell off. Uh, I'd like to say that it was because school got a lot more hectic, which it did, uh, but I, I think it's mainly due to the fact that a new game came out, or new and new. Uh, in a game series that I've been playing a lot over the like last nine years. Uh, yeah. Uh, it's it's called FIFA and uh, it can be a serious time sink if you're like into it. Uh, it has a lot of stuff to like do outside of just playing matches and well it's also got playing matches. So you can spend a lot of time in like the menus and outside of the game on your computer and just it can generally just take up a lot of headspace. Uh, I think I've dealt with the problem now, uh, but it did. It, it, it came out in like uh, start of completely at the start of October and it's just killed my time. Uh, but I've, I've dealt with it now though, so I think it should should be fine going forwards. Uh, I've maintained my Duolingo streak, uh, which is now at like 61 days. Uh, and keeping the streak isn't really all that hard. Like You just kind of check in every day and you get a bunch of reminders anyways if, you, if you're if you kind of being a bit sloppy. Uh, I've uh, kind of stopped doing new things on Duolingo and I just kind of keep it for the streak and just repeat things for score because when you've maxed out one you get more score and you can have a couple of them wrong but like you don't get them wrong when you've when you just redo the same eight that you've done like ten times already um big thing that's like been noticeable in terms of my slipping has been my Anki work and uh, my uh, like show watching uh, for the mass immersion so first on um, with like the Anki uh, I think I added a bit too much too soon I had like I have one set of hiragana one set of katakana which was completely fine it didn't really take a lot of time then I had one human Japanese uh, thing which I think is a very good set. It seems very good at least. It is. It has a lot of stuff in it, but that's been taking a bit of time. Uh, then I added <laughs> uh, two kanji sets, which I think was a mistake, because I want to write down all the kanji, and writing down all the kanji takes a lot of time. Uh, and that's with the other factors has just made it so that I just didn't feel like opening Anki. Uh, at a certain point, because like uh, when uh, you get a new thing on Anki every day, so when you've kind of just stopped, you get a backlog, and after clearing the backlog once and then getting a new backlog, I just kind of gave up, or didn't give up, but I just kind of it just slid all the way off, and uh, I I should probably have addressed it when it happened, but I didn't, uh, which was probably a mistake. Uh, then. For my watching, I finished or I started and finished Death Note, uh, and I've been watching a couple of movies here and there. I watched one about uh, it was about a man who took care of his grandfather's illegitimate child after he passed away. It was it was it was a pretty good movie, but uh, for shows, I've been struggling a lot. Uh, I would be happy, really happy, if someone gave me some good recommendations for some shows that are on uh, Netflix Japan because uh, like the shit of, the, the stuff I've been watching right now it's not been great uh, I, I've tried like three four different shows and all of them it's just like I've, I've gone through two three episodes and then it's just no because it's so so like clear where stuff goes and things are just it's just kind of painful because I cringe really hard at stuff that's cringy and it gets pretty bad so with that I would say that my watch time has gone down drastically from the first month and I'm going to try to pick it up uh, next month although I haven't found anything I like watching but 
I'll just watch regardless because it's also a matter of discipline and I think I'm going to be a lot more disciplined the upcoming months. Uh, to then go on to a bit more of a positive thing, uh, as I've said, I think I've addressed the FIFA problem. I deleted, um, what I did was I deleted my club, which I'd had since 2012, uh, which was not that fun to delete, but but uh, it had to be done because I'm, I'm being very serious about this and trying my best to learn Japanese and then I, I can't let distractions like that cost me, you know? So... Uh, I've also pretty much gotten done with learning hiragana and like being able to read hiragana uh, but I'm uh, now working on being able to output uh, not in terms of speaking or anything but working on outputting text so that I can find the characters when I need the characters and I, that I can write them out so I'm working on both katakana and uh, hiragana simultaneously and I think uh, I'm, I'm writing just like um, sets of five and going, for instance, with the ka, ki, ku, ke, ko. And then I'm just writing those like one line of hiragana, one line karakana, and then going line, line, line. Uh, and then just do that for a page or half a page and then switch up to different letters. Uh, it's it's a bit boring, but I think it's a good way to memorize. Uh, so yeah, that's about it. Um, I'm feeling pretty optimistic about the upcoming month since I've I feel like I've addressed some of the issues I've seen when doing the review for this video. Uh, and uh, yeah, uh, just like last time, I would uh, probably <laughs> I would recommend that you subscribe if you want to watch the following uh, update video for next month because yeah you'll probably forget <laughs> uh, and that's about it so i'll see you next time